First detected in 2017, the formidable sugarcane aphid Cepha flava had spread all over Mauritius within a year. It became a serious threat to pasture grass, an important fodder crop in deer ranches. Our project focuses on biological control, which represents the organic way to counter the threat to our pasture. So far, we have achieved the recovery of four different species of predators. The first one is the largest lady beetle present in Mauritius, Chilomenes sulfura. The adult and larva of this beetle are both voracious feeders of the yellow sugarcane aphid. An adult lives for about three months and feeds on an average of 300 aphids daily. Hoverfly is another predator that has been identified as a potential biological control agent. The adult of this species hovers over flowers to feed solely on pollen and nectar. However, the larva of this fly is a voracious feeder of the yellow sugarcane aphid. The larva feeds on the aphid, sucking out the body content and leaving behind its empty exoskeleton. The third predator recovered preying on the yellow sugarcane aphid as a small lady beetle of the Skimnus species. Both the adult and larva of this species feed on the yellow sugarcane aphid. Here we can see the larva of this beetle feeding on the pest. The last potential biological control agent recovered is the brown lacewing, Micromus timidus. Both adult and larva of this predator feed on the yellow sugarcane aphid. The larva possesses a pencil-like mouthpart adapted for piercing and sucking. Here, we can see the larva piercing and sucking the body content of the yellow sugarcane aphid. <laughs> 